And welcome back to GMI. Well, are you thinking about selling electronics or other valuables on eBay? You want to watch out for a new scam. Using a few tricks, scammers fool sellers into shipping goods without receiving payments. So Better Business Bureau's Dale Dixon joins us this morning to tell us, first of all, Dale, good morning, and Hello. how does this scam work? So it works with you put your item for sale on eBay, you go through the entire process just as you would expect, and then you have a buyer. So everything looks good. The buyer, all of a sudden, after the eBay sale is complete, the buyer contacts you and they will come up with a great story that they are in the military, that they have a son or daughter that they need to get this item to immediately and they're going to ask you to speed up the shipping process. Of course. And you'll say, well, as soon as I get payment, I will ship this out, understanding that you are looking to get this quickly. And then when you see an email come through, it's going to look like it's coming from PayPal. It'll say that there is money in the account okay. for this purchase. But if you were to go and check your PayPal account, there is no money there. Interesting. So the email tells you there is, it's not there. So, and besides that email, is there anything else that people should look out for? I assume there's more warning signs than probably just that. Yeah, the, the yeah. email is definitely the biggest one. And the reason is, is that they're spoofing the PayPal email. Okay. So they're creating a, uh, a look-alike is what they're doing here. And the biggest thing that we're seeing is that uh, the folks who are making these purchases or pseudo purchases don't have any kind of a history on eBay. So mm. the first thing that you should do is look at your buyer's history on eBay. And if you see that they're brand new and they're just popping up, check the profile. Okay. And that should be a big red flag. Next thing is that you're going to verify uh, at your PayPal account. Don't just take an email at face value, but you're going to be sure and look and see that it has the at paypal.com at the extension of the email and also check your email account. Yes, very good advice. And you can let PayPal know if you think you have been the victim of of this fraud, Absolutely, right? You can yeah. tell them. So send, just forward the email that you receive. If you are a victim of this scam or if somebody sends you a fake email saying you have a PayPal, then go ahead and send it to the spoof at paypal.com. Uh, PayPal would love to see it. Interesting. And one yeah. more thing real quick, bad grammar. You mentioned that in your yes. notes today. So look yeah. at the bad grammar can be a big giveaway. It right? can be. Yeah. Read that PayPal email very carefully to be sure that uh, that the grammar is correct, the spelling is correct. Otherwise, uh, that is a big red flag for folks. And that's an easy one to spot. You can easy see right spot. away. Absolutely. Okay, great advice. And if folks need more information, they can go to BBB website, right? Absolutely. We're online all the time, BBB.org. Excellent. And of course, we'll post a link on our website as well for you, Dale. Thanks for being with us. Thank you. All right. And coming up next.